Good afternoon, everybody. It's January 2nd, 2023, and we're going to continue on this series of details, details of a beautiful bicycle. So one thing that's wonderful about cycling is the beauty and not just the sport itself, the equipment, how we personalize our bikes, how we make them just look incredible. And this Cannondale 1987 ST400 Touring Edition is a perfect example of it. Okay, so let's start with the details. Uh, the red, the red against uh, the white paint looks really good. Um, the uh, All the cable ends have red uh, caps on them. So uh, let's take a quick look. Check that out. The red and black look pedals blend perfectly into the bike. The podium water bottles against the chrome bottle cages just look smart. Even my tire levers are red. And, you know, that's a speed sleeve quick bag. Basically, it's just a strap. So it has my tube and my two red tire levers. Um, my SRAM grip, bar tape. This looks really good. And at first I was questioning whether to use red on it. And the reason I used red is because that's what I had on the bars. I had bought it really cheap for like $8.50 on Amazon. And that's SRAM uh, cork tape. So it's really good tape. Normally I wouldn't put a computer on an old bike. But this is white and red. So it blended in beautifully. The chrome bits on the bike just keep the bike looking period correct. About the only thing that probably isn't accurate or, or looks perfect on this bike is that black saddle. Um, and it's not because it's black. The black looks good. It's because it's a little too modern of a sa saddle for a 1987 bike. The gum walls, you guys know how I feel about gum walls. They set these bikes off. So what I love about this bike, it just classic, classic looking bicycle. Um, this bike um, had a hard life. You know, you saw it when it was a scuffed up blue with uh, 700C tires on 27 and a quarter inch rims. You, you saw the way it looked. Uh, scraped up everywhere. The chrome was pretty much just beat up to hell. Um, but all it took was a little polishing. All it took was a little TLC. You know, um, the chain is brand new. And what I did wrong with this chain is I couldn't find a, a silver chain for the six-speed hub. So basically, um, it's a quick leak chain, a really nice chain. But it was designed for this old, old steel hub. And uh, the rear derailleur... Uh, be, while I was cleaning it, I ended up scraping off the Shimano 600 uh, logo on it. Uh, but now it's just a polished rear derailleur. Alloy body just looks really, really good. Uh, the cranks are looking really nice. Uh, the front derailleur looks good. You guys know the brake calipers are old Shimano 600. Just classic looking. Um, I'm just not a big fan of those blocks of uh, of brake pads. I got to do something, make it look a little bit more bling, a little bit nicer looking. Um, so I got to start searching for some new brake pads. And those brake pads are some old, old brake pads. So uh, a new set of uh, chrome backing brake pads would look beautiful on this bike. But uh, that's what I like about this bike. It just looks good. Um, the red, the contrast of red and black and white look really nice. Um, you know, from the front end, it could be a modern bike, you know. But the reality is it's down tube shifters. Uh, just a clean looking bike. I even like it the way it looks from the back, you know, with those big chain stays on it. Those are some hefty chain stays. I know I mention that a lot. I just can't get over how big they are. Um, that's like mountain bike chain stays. Um, so overall the bike came out great. Yeah, the paint, um, you guys all know it's rattle can paint. Um, uh, and what I've been doing is I've been, um, starting to sand it again. Um, and just getting the rough spots off. So I might strip it down again. And this time just put a, a beautiful clear coat on it. But at the moment, 
No, because I have too many other little projects I've been working on. Um, but the details are nice on this bike. Um, what's left to do to it? Nothing. Just just ride it, enjoy it, and uh, you know, keep it looking super clean. All right, guys. Again, if you guys have any questions or you're restoring an old bike, let me know. Let me see the pictures of it. Um, you know, show me what you have, and I, I'll continue sharing my bicycles with you guys. Okay, guys. Have a great day, and I hope everybody's having a great New Year.